So the studio projects will take lots of different forms. I mean, the studio projects are a way in which the ideas are made real, that the ideas can bump up against the real world, concrete problems, and demonstrate how they would reframe and re-express those problems through, through different kinds of perspectives. They will take the form of cinema, they will take the form of software, they will take the form of policy, they will take the form of text. Together, one hopes, they will represent a kind of emergent school of thought, where one that may look very different than the other actually feels like it's in the same universe as the other, that they, they constitute a kind of portfolio of possibilities for how we might, uh, for how we might re as I say, reorient planetary scale computation in a different way. Thinking back to some of the other previous programs that we've done, I think back to ways in which some of the projects that ended up having the most long-lasting impact were not necessarily those that had a lot of impact right away, uh, and vice versa. In many cases, the impact of some of the projects is how they are imitated and how they take on a life of their own. Right? There may be some projects where we're like, this is great, this is a lovely idea, let's do it. There may be other projects that, rep that have implications that reorient or reframe the problem in a way that resonates, and it may resonate over a longer period of time. And it comes, you end up seeing the impact in the subsequent work by other people that was inspired or who thought about it as a kind of new foundational gesture. In other words, there's a lot of value to kind of you know, reorienting the angle by which something is moving on its momentum because in a few years time, that reorientation has, has shifted it quite, quite dramatically. We want to make new philosophy. We want to generate uh, a kind of school of thought around philosophy in relationship to technology, but we also want this thinking to have impact. Um, but impact can mean a lot, of different, a lot of different things. And to the extent to which that impact would mean other people who are not part of the program, inspired, engaging with the work, it's wonderful. There's probably two ways in which the work could be brought up, could be engaged with the work of, of policy and political thought in different kinds of ways. Some maybe more immediate, tactical, and pragmatic, and other more, more higher level or conceptual. We'll be working with around very concrete problems, carbon taxation or carbon pricing, AI regulation. These are very specific kinds of issues that we can engage with from a number, a number of different perspectives. There's already a lot of policy thinking going around these as well. I'd like to think that our perspective on these will be provide a different angle that may, uh, that may uh, may prove efficacious in ways in which others, others don't. But as a philosophy program, it may be in some ways that the ways in which uh, our impact on the policy sphere may be most profound is in thinking about what are we making policy about? Like, where is the policy intervention ne needs to happen? Who needs to be at the table in relationship to this policy intervention? What, what mechanisms and institutions need to be at work and in play in order for this kind of intervention to actually uh, have the traction and impact that it, that it would need to have. It very well may be that the political institutions that we have inherited from the late 20th century are not the right platforms for the implementations of the policies we need for the 21st century.